Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Tonight, we will be playing a horror game called Tenebris Somnia. I think that's how you say it at least. It is a 2D survival horror adventure with live action cutscenes. Unveil a disturbing story by solving puzzles and fighting horrible creatures. Every night I have the same nightmare. I see my ex-boyfriend being killed by horrible creatures. I didn't talk to him again after we broke, but these dreams don't let me rest. I tried to contact him without success. I still have the key to his apartment. His apartment is on the third floor. space to interact. Can we sit down? I always hated this cardboard living room. It looks like the decoration of a cheap talk show. We'll shift to run. Okay, that's bad. Okay, so, so we're someone that's trying to contact our boyfriend who went missing. Or dead at least, I think. I won't bother Mr. Stillman. Better I go to the third floor. Does the elevator work? There you go. We lived together here for a couple of years until I left. For a while, it was hard for me to stop calling it our apartment and thinking about it as his apartment. I guess the same thing happens with the key that weighs in my pocket. It's no longer our key, it's his key. Why did I keep it all this time? This time I will not take it home again. I won't bother my old neighbors. I will go directly to apartment B, okay. Look at the art. On the on the walls though. This is the fire escape? I want to know if Ivan is okay. Yeah. Ivan? Are you there? I knock, but there is no answer. can go in now. I'm sure he's okay. Positive thinking. It's still the typical apartment of two movie fans. Well, only one now. He's moving in film festival posters. This is a poster of For Devour. The short film he made in film school. Oh, wow. I printed it. Framed it and gave it to him on his birthday. It's broken for some reason. Do we keep receipts, papers, and anything bureaucratic? Also, we were horror fans as well. Movie. Movie horror fans. These are the cans where he kept his short films. They're empty. Oh, okay. This guy. He went into the satanic route. Lots of books about cinema. Many of them are mine. Should I take them with me? Okay, let's explore everything. Oh, there's, there's one wheel up top. Chemistry books. He was always interested in working with film and hated recording on video or digital. Thanks to these books, he was able to film and develop his own short film. It's too complex for me. Like an alien language. Something smells really bad. The trash. Nothing important. Okay. What is this? Black fire. What? It's the short film. He burnt the film. Why? This short is what he loves most in the world. 
Why did he burn the film? Did we pick it up? I don't think so. It's almost empty. There is a developing chemical that needs to be kept in cold storage. I remember it was one of the most expensive. We got development chemical. Or developing chemical. What the hell? It's empty. What is this on the wall? The fuse box. Nothing strange. The chemistry book with highlighted sentences. Tartaric acid is one of the key components used to alter colors in the developing process. Blood is another iron rich substance. Also, who's making fake blood? The kitchen counter is quite dry, quite dirty. The kitchen counter is quite dirty. Okay, so he was probably making fake blood, right? That's fake blood on the door. Let's check everything. Oh, he's got a lot of fake blood. It's cracked. And there's blood in the glass. You break it with a punch. He was never a violent person. I used to keep my things in this cabinet. Now it's full of crap. Among the shampoo and the lotions, there are some developing chemicals, especially those that smell horrible. I even kept them here because he didn't want to contaminate the whole house. I won't touch them. The trophies that he won for his short film are dumped in that toilet. What? We have two as well. What the hell? This wrench looks heavy. Maybe I can, maybe I can use it for something. I got wrench. Hmm. I'm surprised we have two toilets. What the hell? So we have a wrench. And this, it's a toner. It's used to correct the colors of the image during the developing process. It's heavy, it's heavy, it can hurt. Okay. Someone broke the TV. I don't like this at all. Okay, we're gonna go into that satanic, satanic looking door soon. I just need to check everything else. The trophies I've been won for a short film were ex exhibited on this table. There's only one left. It's locked. Or it's barricaded. Why did he board the window? This book on the floor. Why is this old book on the floor? I got old book. It can only read pages one and nine. The others are blurred. It's pure esoteric nonsense. Why did you get into it, Ivan? <laughs> Old book. Oh. The desiderium is sealed from the outside world by the sulfur symbol and a layer of lapis fictus, which is red and hard as diamond. It can only be dissolved by aritzatio. To obtain aritzatio, you need the acids of the tartarus Tamed by iron and blessed by sunlight. You need the essence of the Tartarus. Tamed by iron and blessed by sunlight. Oh, what did this guy do? I remember I always wanted to sleep, leaving the curtains open to feel the morning light. He could not stand the sunlight on his face. That's why we slept in absolute darkness, like two vampires. This room could use some sunlight. Are we going to open them? This is also boarded up. It's boarded. The blinds never worked well, but this is crazy. The lower board is loose. Maybe I can remove it if I hit it with something heavy. Oh. You have a wrench. 
control and then press space to attack. There you go. Will we do it with all of them? The sunlight sneaks in a little. Okay, never mind. This frame had the photo we took at the premiere of his short film, but the photo was gone. I know this bed more than myself. I wonder if he's been with someone else since then. Not my problem, though. Nothing important here. There's an empty glass. Okay, we got... Pretty sure we interacted with everything we could. Actually, let me hit this. Okay, no, that doesn't work. That's actually boarded up well. Let's think. We have the apartment key. The glass. I don't know who that, that for. Who that be for now? Okay, we're going to this satanic door. The study door does not open. It's sealed by this weird substance. At least it's not blood. It's like some kind of very hard red wax. Are you in there, Ivan? Okay, so I think that's what we got the book for. To tell us how to open that. We could combine stuff. Glass with chemical. I put the toner in the glass. I can't believe I will use this blood. It's dry. I don't know how to add it to the glass. Ouch. How stupid I cut myself with the glass. Well, I guess my own blood will do. Glass with chemical and blood. What else did it need? It said... You need the acids of the Tartarus tamed by iron and blessed by sunlight. Okay, so we need, we need to go to the room, right? And put it in the sun. Well, we could run. Let's do that. Okay, so this should work, right? Yes. The liquid in the glass turned into a strange color. And gives off a lot of heat. I got Aritzatio. Okay. Week for cooking. Now watch this. Boom. The red thing melted. I can enter now. But do I want to? Maybe those weren't just nightmares. Oh, what? This is the gamer room. He, he reviews movies for a prestigious website with his computer. He's a pretty harsh critic. The screen is broken. He kept the short film cans in this box. It's empty. This is all his blood? What happened here? It's the red substance again. Hard as stone. The remote control for the TV and it's stuck to the table. I can see that it has no batteries, even so, TV's broken, so it's useless. I bought this plant in the worst moment of our relationship. I needed to see something flourishing because our relationship was dying. I see that Ivan left it to die once I left. Ivan's cell phone is stuck to the floor by the red thing. The screen's cracked, but the phone might still work. Shit, the battery is dead. These are the costumes we used in the short film. It's all over the place and there are some things missing. Looks like Ivan wrote it. I can't forget her, no matter how hard I try. I can't forget Julia. Ever since she left, I do nothing but think about her and suffer her absence. They promised me... It would help me forget her. They say the first step is to descend through the elevators to the lowest floor. Forget me to move on with this life. 
What have you done? What kind of lunatics have you been messing with, Ivan? There's something on the floor. I got a green candle. The message mentions the elevator. I should check it out. Oh, don't tell me he. Here there were two pictures that I took. I imagine he got rid of them. It's okay. I don't want them back. An elevator. What the hell? Something weird. It's as if the air was different. It's not just the air. The whole place got like a renovation. And there's something purple here. I got Lavendolum. Oh, how's the outside? Is it open? Oh, it's night. It's pitch black outside. When did it get dark? It's locked. It has some engraved symbol. What type of key is that? We don't have it. I can't ensure it's made of wax. Substance can heal me a little. Oh, no. Does the dialogue change? No, no, no. Everything's still the same, just... Oh, and the door is open. It's locked. It has an engraved symbol. And this one has a 7. Okay. Let's go to the elevator then. Who opened the door? Oh! This is what I was talking about. Look. Fight, we don't fight, we run. I think. Oh, no, we don't. Oh. We got her. What was that? That thing tried to kill me. It looked like the creature that gutted Ivan in my nightmares. Oh no. Was all I dreamed real? Or am I still dreaming? Let's check our health. Oh yeah, we were, we were close to death. Consume. She dropped something. There's a piece of meat. Where the creature was standing. It's grayed up. Like rotten. I want to touch it. So do we still go down the elevator? Let's check. Yeah. Yeah, everything changed. It's jammed. It won't open. The art is still the same. And this one is locked. It has an engraved symbol as well. Oh, the elevator actually works. This nightmare has just begun. Thanks for playing the demo. Oh, shh. Don't forget to wishlist the game. Well, that was it for Tenebris Somnia. Hope I'm saying it right. But I really like this style of horror game. This might be the first, uh, like, pixel horror game we've actually checked out. I don't know when it comes out. I'll have to check that later. But I really like it. I like that style, the switch up it has. It goes from like 2D, like pixelated to live action. For the story, I guess it's like your regular story, you know. Our ex, we can't get over our ex. And we we're going to go check up on him, but he ended up doing something really bad. Just so that he could forget about us. So it's, it's kind of like relationship problems, but it is what it is for the story. The jump scares, I... It wasn't jump scares, but I really like the monster design. The way it was 
he came out when we were trying to go into the elevator and he's just outside of the door. You see his feet. And then you like, we actually see the entire face of the monster with like a big tongue, like a lizard or something. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you all in the next video.